The updated version of the Asus ROG Zephyrus G14 GA401 has some interesting new things under the hood like AMD Zen 3 CPUs and NVIDIA Ampere GPUs. So, powerful hardware that is fitted in a shell of a compact 14-incher, it may sound exciting to a lot of you. First of all, the build quality is very good, the lid is made of aluminum and we have a magnesium alloy base. The design of the laptop is a distinctive one, the anime matrix is an optional extra but it's very interesting, 1215 hidden mini LEDs that support 256 levels of brightness each, and can be used to show custom animations, text messages, music audio levels, and other cool stuff. The device feels like a compact piece of hardware and it really is. It weighs about 1.6 kilograms while being 17.9 to 19.9 millimeters thick. However, it sports a full-size keyboard which is very comfortable to use. Furthermore, this is the first Raj laptop to feature fingerprint login on the power button, making waking up the laptop as simple as unlocking your phone. The Ergo Lift hinge lifts the base of the laptop, providing even more fresh air for the intake fans which affects positively the performance of the cooling solution, but more on that later. On the sides, we can spot an HDMI 2.0 connector, two USB Type-C 3.1 generation 2 ports, one of which has power delivery and display port 1.4 capabilities, two USB Type-A 3.1 generation 1 ports, a 3.5mm audio jack, and a Kensington lock slot. The sound department is represented by four speakers, two of them are rated at 0.7 watts while the other two have 2.5 watts of power. They support Dolby Atmos audio, while the two-way AI noise cancellation makes voice chat crystal clear. You can get the new GA401 with a 144Hz Full HD panel or with a 120Hz QHD IPS1. We chose the latter for our tests and we're pretty happy with the results. It has a good maximum brightness of 348 nits and a decent contrast ratio 1050 to 1. But here's the amazing part, it covers not only the full sRGB gamut but also 100% of the wider DCI-P3 color space. In other words, it can show a huge amount of colors, just like a professional monitor. Furthermore, it doesn't use PWM across all brightness levels so it's suitable for long gaming sessions. This laptop is equipped with a 76 watt hours battery brick and it's a true king in its category. We conduct the battery tests with Windows Better Performance setting turned on, and screen brightness adjusted to 120 nits. During our tests, it scored 16 hours and 40 minutes of web browsing, and exactly 10 hours of video playback, awesome. When it comes to upgradeability, the laptop comes with a single stick of soldered 8GB or 16GB DDR4 RAM, but there is one free slot so the maximum possible memory configuration in dual channel mode is 32GB of DDR4 3200MHz RAM. In terms of storage, there is a single M.2 PCI Express NVMe drive. The cooling solution looks promising, with its 84-blade arc flow blades, liquid metal compound, and upgraded self-cleaning technology. There are four heat pipes in total, three pipes are shared for cooling the CPU and the GPU while the other one is solely dedicated to the memory modules and the VRAMs. GA401's 2020 predecessor has five heat pipes but it seems that the new unit is doing a better job. While the 2020 version was keeping the CPU frequency around 3.0 GHz mark in long loads, the improved cooling system in the 2021 variant maintains 3.50 GHz average effective frequency while the CPU reaches 87 degrees Celsius. Not bad at all for such a compact notebook. Here are the results from our real-life gaming test. We've put the results of the 2020 predecessor as well, so we can see the improvement, no matter the fact that the last year's model uses the less powerful GeForce RTX 2060 Max-Q with 65W TGP. As you've just seen, we've got a configuration with the AMD Ryzen 5920's HS processor and an NVIDIA GeForce RTX 3060 which in our case has a TGP of 80 watts. This duo will let you play heavy games like Cyberpunk 2077 or GTA 5 with 60 FPS at max settings, 
while Doom Eternal takes full advantage of the 120Hz screen providing an average of 125fps at Ultra Nightmare settings. Check for yourself. In conclusion, this 14-inch machine remains one of the best offers on the market and if you're on the hunt for a powerful and compact laptop you should definitely shortlist it. No matter if you're a gamer, content creator, or developer, thanks to its performance and features, G14 turned out to be a great, one unit to rule them all, solution.